It's the month of December and typically, tis the season to be jolly. However, for Virginia Tech students, tis the season of finals. It leads to all sorts of different stress levels for students during crunch time of exam week. I'm not too stressed. Um, I have a good support system in terms of uh, friends in my class. Freshman year, I would have probably been stressed around this time because this is my first time getting into college level classes and stuff like that. Students cope with stress in all kinds of different ways. However, one furry friend is a fan favorite. Meet Moose, the six-year-old yellow lab who works at Cook Counseling Center as a therapy dog. Moose was originally a guide dog for the blind in New York but a medical concern landed him at Virginia Tech with his owner, Trent Davis, a counselor at the center. I didn't train Moose to be well behaved and calm. He came that way, but I, I did have to bond with Moose just like um, any relationship. And now we've been a team for about four and a half years. During those four and a half years, Davis has seen how Moose has been instrumental to Virginia Tech students, particularly during a time like finals week. It's really amazing when someone walks up to Moose, all of a sudden their expression changes, uh, whether or not they've ever met him before, or whether or not they're really even a dog person. They just take one look at him and it makes them smile. Moose helps cure a lot of the homesickness that students may be feeling at the end of a semester. And he can even be a substitute for students' own pups back home. It feels really good because I have a dog at home, but I haven't seen him since, well, I've seen him once since the school year started and in high school he was a big stress reliever for me to be able to be with him and then having Moose on campus, it's kind of like being at home. There's something special about a dog that can take all the stress away, even if just for a moment that a human can't provide. There's some theories that humans are kind of wired to be connected to nature and a dog will basically provide that connection that we might not get otherwise. They're just there to kind of listen to you if you want to talk to them or just sit there with you. One dog bringing some early joy to the world before students can head home and officially celebrate Christmas. Reporting from the campus of Virginia Tech, this is Corey Van Dyke.